Please be advised, this video contains spoilers for the Voyage episode, The Enemies. Okay, this is one of the dark, grim season one episodes in black and white. In a nutshell, these two guys are commies. They drug people on an island, a mysterious misty island. Captain Crane and Admiral Nelson land on the island and they get drugged by these two communist cretins. Now, at this stage, some of you might be shaking your head saying, yeah, that's all good and well, but I thought this was a science fiction channel and what the hell does all this have to do with science fiction? Do you remember the third season Lost in Space episode titled Hunter's Moon, where John Robinson was hunted down on a mysterious planet by an alien named uh, Megazor? Well, my first viewing of for this episode of Voyage the Enemies, I was basically saying, hang on, this is Hunter's Moon on an island. <laughs> so yeah, I would say it does have a science fiction related feeling to it. The enemies might not be science fiction, but it certainly has a uh, slightly bizarre element in the early sections of it. Nelson and Crane step into this room and find this. I am not going to give an explanation as to what this is, but I just wish to say it is one of the most bizarre images to appear in the whole 110 episodes of Voyage to the Bottom of the Sea. Direction is absolutely brilliant in this episode. Just about everything in this episode is absolutely brilliant. Okay, this is where the spoiler comes. This episode has one of the best written endings you could possibly imagine. Nelson gets wind of the fact that the water supply on this tiny island is being contaminated. So uh, what Nelson does is he makes sure the uh, contaminated water actually goes to these two clowns in front of you. And we never actually find out what happens when they drink the water. But it's a brilliant ending. It's an, I mean, it's um, sort of simply done, but incredibly well written. And uh, I, would, I would rank the enemies as having one of the best written enemies, best, best written endings in the whole 110 episodes of Voyage to the Bottom of the Sea. Next episode. The Human Computer. And this is uh, one of the several episodes where one or two of the regular cast members of Voyage are left all alone on submarine sea view to deal with some uh, mysterious enemy that they're not really sure about. Um, boy, this uh, plotline was copied so many times in the colour seasons. Let's talk about the 20th Century Fox uh, hardware, these blinking light computers that appeared in the Irwin Allen TV shows and the Adam West Batman series. Above Robin's head is that uh, box computer, the Bat computer that was so relevant to Batman and Lost in Space, and it's in this episode of Voyage. In this episode, we see the Sea View control room, room look totally different to its normal usage. In childhood, in the 1970s, I looked at this episode and said, Wow! The Bat computer, the Lost in Space computers, they're in Voyage. Wow! Okay, there it is. Yeah, we all love the hardware. At least I do. Stu from Australia, signing out.